You've likely seen video of the F-A-18 Hornet. The two-seater fighter jet has been used by the Navy since the 1980s. They have a max speed of 1,200 miles per hour and can travel for thousands of miles. But what about that pilot? To absorb G-force, the pilots wear a special G-suit. It's tight, but functional. It's basically tied tight to your body because that's going to be what helps prevent the blood when you're pulling G's in the jet from uh, dropping from your brain and blacking out. So that's pretty much a lifesaver. Pilots also wear a harness that's attached to a parachute. If you pull it like that, that's how you tighten it up. And on top of that, a survival vest. So then from here, normally you'd have a radio in here. It's getting inspected. Uh -huh. uh, you got your camel back attached for water. So if you're thirsty in the jet, okay. you have your oxygen mask. This is how you talk on the radios as well. As you can see in here, there's a microphone for communications. Uh, so that's how we talk to each other. And then uh, that'll plug into your helmet so you can hear through your helmet uh, on the radios. Uh, this is a flotation device for uh, if you eject over water, you can pull those um, and it'll help you float. You mentioned there was a camelback with water. What if you have to go to the bathroom when you're out there? <laughs> so the bathrooms, actually, hold on, I'll grab you one. <laughs> <laughs> They're called a pedal pack. So it's a plastic bag. Uh, it's got some absorbent material here. So this is how you go to the bathroom. Uh, it'll fill up with like a gel, Yep. and then you close it, and uh, put it in your bag and hope you don't spill it until you get back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Does that answer? Yeah. There's also a piddle pack for women. Ha, ha, ha.